Yeah, I, I thought it was a, a very solid game for us from start to finish. I thought we played the full 60 minutes. We had four lines going, all six defensemen. In regards to the forwards, we didn't try. You know, we didn't shortchange anybody. The ice time was spread out pretty evenly, at least when we were five on five. Uh, one of the things I was real impressed with, uh, we took a few penalties early, but we stopped that. And, uh, you know, we were doing a little bit of research prior to the game and looking at a record when we give up uh, four or less power plays in the game versus our record when we give up five or more. And uh, it's uh, pretty eye-opening. And uh, so we're heading the right direction when it came to that. We, we, you know, we held them over three on the power play. But I did think the guys played a real inspired game. And, and not that we didn't last night. It's just... Um, we're off by about five percent, and then and uh, Bemidji's really, really a good hockey team. They've got you know early in the year, I think they had some go goaltending woes, um, but they've got their goaltending squared around, and they've got a quality, quality hockey team. And so I think to get the win, we'd had to be full marks for that, and we had to cure that five percent from yesterday to today. And uh, also, I was uh, happy to see Charles uh, have a strong performance today. Um, Obviously, uh, faced uh, uh, over 30 shots, only gave up one goal, and more than anything, looked comfortable in the net, and good good on him. Ryan Zoot, Big Rapids Pioneer. Obviously, after getting shut out last night, looking for an offensive spark, and you did it from your two top stores tonight. How big is that to have your, your guys who have been leading you all season to jumpstart you there? Well, you know what? Great question, Ryan. It's very important, and it was it was good to see uh, Gerald show up on the on the score sheet as, as well as Corey Mack, and it was good to see us get a power play goal. Um, nice play uh, out of the corner from uh, Jared Van Wormer, and uh, on, on the second goal was really a nice feed by uh, Durani's, um, where I thought he was getting ready to shoot it and fed it back to, uh, to Corey in, in the slot, so... Um, it was good goals, but it was good, uh, good all-around team play as well. Imagine when he gets that puck in the slot. I mean, he doesn't typically miss from there, does he? Well, he needs a, he he could shoot more. You know, that's the one thing. He seems like he, uh, tonight, at least, he bypassed a couple opportunities where you know he could go ahead and let it fly. So he, he's a good he's good distributing the puck. I mean, he's got great vision on the ice, but sometimes maybe needs to be a little bit selfish in the scoring areas. After uh, 0 for 4 to start on the power play tonight, and maybe pressing a little bit. And then Gerald did see you guys tied up there. Talk about the momentum swing on, on the bench from, from that goal. Well, it had been a long time since we scored a power play goal. It had been quite some time. And while we had good looks and we had some opportunities, um, it starts to wear on you a little bit. And, and uh, I think even the guys will tell you it's good to have that power play goal. Um, I thought the power play looked fairly sharp tonight. Zone entry was pretty clean most of the time. Um, so, yeah, no, it was good to get the goal. And... and you know, even though we haven't been clicking on the power play, I, I have watched the last few games. It seems like we're getting opportunities. Just you know, now maybe pucks pucks will go in for us. Uh, what was the difference for for Charles tonight? Did you see? Obviously, you said he played a pretty good game, and did he look more comfortable in the net, or what did you see from him? Well, I think uh, I wouldn't say uh, the difference is tonight. I, I think the difference really is really come around the last two weeks. I thought a week ago leading into the Lake Superior State Series, he had a really good week of practice, Very looked very comfortable. It might even start before that, really started to find his game in, uh, through practice. And then would have gotten to start uh, probably last weekend, but, you know, Darren won the game on Friday night. I th think he had a shutout that night, and, you know, you hate to hate to uh, uh, pull a goalie after, after that situation. Um, we pretty much do another quality week this week of practice for, for Charles. So regardless of how last night's game went, we were pretty darn certain going into the weekend it was going to be a Friday-Saturday split with the two. And uh, But the difference really has been coming along the last couple of weeks and not just a, a one night, oh, okay, you know, it, it, came, it, it came through a lot of hard work. Um, yeah. Uh, I was actually going to come off the ice, and I heard the guys uh, saying, stay on, stay on, so I kind of made my way towards the net. Uh, Anselmini carried the puck in. It was a real nice play by him. Gave it to Van Wormer. Uh, Van Wormer made an unbelievable pass to me, and I just kind of shot it right away, and it beat, it beat the goalie. So it's always good to score uh, when you're kind of struggling. Obviously, no, don't, you don't like to get shut out on home ice. What was said before the game tonight to kind of give that push back and come out on top tonight? Uh, we knew what we had to do. Um, we've been in this position before. Um, we just we just can't panic when stuff's not going our way. Um, you know, the the captains and the assistant captains uh, they they you know they they walk us through stuff. And if if someone's down, you know they'll they'll come and get us up. And 
as a group, I think we all knew what we, we had to do tonight, and, and we accomplished it tonight, so it was good. Yeah, your thoughts on, on Charles? I know he gave up that one early, but shut the door the rest of the way. Yeah, uh, Charles was unbelievable tonight. Uh, like Coach said, he, uh, he was comfortable in that, and we had to bail him out. Sometimes uh, it's not your fault as a goalie, and I think that's what happened in the last games he was playing, and we didn't really bail him out. And tonight he had some critical sl saves um, when we kind of kind of left him in the, the dirt, but um, proud of him. Seems like the midpoint here of the year for hockey season. How do you guys feel as a group going into the next season, next semester, going into being more on the road? Yeah, um, I, th I think we're a better road team, uh, to be honest. Uh, I like playing on the road. Uh, I know the other, some of the other guys do too. And I think this win is, is a good confidence builder for everyone. So we got to keep moving forward, keep working hard in practice, battling, uh, winning pucks, and, and things will go our way. Feels good, feels good. Um, like I said, the team bailed me out quite a bit out there. Um, blocking a lot of shots, but um, you know, in the end, yeah, I felt comfortable. It felt uh, like I should be there, and uh, yeah, it was a good turnout. Uh, Coach has talked about your practice the last few weeks. Have you noticed anything different uh, in, in practice to build up to this game? Yeah, big time. Uh, the last few weeks, um, <clears throat> really just been kind of relaxing more and not thinking about so much, and uh, just taking it a step at a time, one day at a time. And yeah, practice has definitely improved um, in terms of feeling comfortable, feeling. I'm like I'm ready and prepared. And, uh, yeah, I had a good, uh, couple of weeks of practice, and um, like I said, it turned out pretty well tonight. Yeah, obviously nearing the midpoint of the season, how would you evaluate the team's performance so far? Um, I think, that, like I said, there's always room for improvement. Um, you know, that's what the season brings. You never know what's going to happen, a lot of ups and downs. But I think, you know, over time we've handled it pretty well, and I think we're heading in the right direction come um, this next point here in the season.